What's going on everybody, it's a YouTube troll here, aka Papa Birdo, and I just got done recording episode live 59 and underdogs, I don't know which episode of underdogs I, was, I, I just got done, but I believe it was 19, I'm not sure, and now I'm recording Hans Boiling Point, and you know, beforehand I wanted to let my, my good friend S. know, thank you so much for the thumbnail, he made the thumbnail for the series as well. And Identity Crisis, I already thanked him for Identity Crisis, and I haven't done a hands boiling point up until now, so I feel like thanking him now. So thank you, Wesdot, I love you, man. Yeah. That was so fucking stupid, but I don't give a fuck. Oh my god, look at this team, man. On the first match, we gotta deal with a fucking Naruto with Neji. God damn it, bitch. Alright, let's see what we can do. I always say that, I always say let's see what we can do, but it always ends up being the same shit. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> oh, that was fun. I don't care that I wasted all myself on that. That was fucking fun. Man, I love his tilt so much. It makes me wet. It gets me wet, guys. It gets me wet, or moist, or very moist, or very wet. Moist towelette, moist towelette. Shitty fucking Naruto, man. Yeah, of course you would awaken, you scrub a derp. He saw that my guard was red, so he's gonna try to awaken or break it. Please, bitch. Hiya, bitch. Ah, oh, whatever. Stupid bitch. Of course, his guard is there. Ah, oh, man. Oh. No time like the present, right? Guard support is a fucking bitch. I keep saying it, and I'm gonna say it again. Guard support is a fucking bitch. It's one of those many annoying things in this game. Oh my god, game. Oh my goodness. That was so stupid, man. But whatever. Whatever, man. Oh, you fucking windmill shuriken, you piece of shit. You, you piece of shit. You dare defile on the name of Han? I don't think so. Tilt mode. Activate. Ah. Tilt mode. Bitch. Tilt mode! Motherfucker, get off of me, you bitch! I don't like counting on my tilt mode, but I'm gonna have to. Damn, man. Wow! I shouldn't have subbed that. Come on, the last tilt mode, can it save me? Can it save me? Can the last tilt mode save me? Find out! On the. Oh my god, the windmill. Never mind. I was going to say find out in this episode of Dragon Ball Z, but it wasn't even worth saying it. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I disappointed you. All right, whatever. Let's go to the second match, guys. Um, I'm going to try to give you guys three matches, so yeah, there's one of them. What's up, people? It's the last, uh, I was about to say it's the last match. My bad. Second match. Um, and the first match I lost, and, and you know what? I'm going to put it up on the video because... It was a good match, in my opinion. Not not in the sense that it was like, oh, he was playing legit and I was playing legit. More like, it, it's it's fun to watch some shit like that. I'm not gonna like spammers are only good for that one thing though, to entertain people on YouTube. Because when it's a boring match against a scrub that that that's not spamming or anything, and it's too easy to beat them, it just becomes boring. Although I, I do bitch because it's annoying as shit, but it's still entertaining to watch, in my opinion. Damn, motherfucker. Yo, this, this guy has double balance. I just noticed that shit. You know, he's planning on doing some fucking, uh, some shuriken spamming, dude. Oh, okay. No, please, Cyberconetu. Don't make jump available for you to dodge fucking, uh, grabs. Let's only make it so you can move out of the way. That's the only way you can fucking block, um, well, a boy getting grabbed. 
moving out of the damn way. Jumping apparently doesn't count as moving out of the fucking way. I'm not saying this game has to be realistic, but come on now, bro. Don't bullshit me, Sabakone 2. Do not bullshit Papa. Just you know. You know Papa will get mad if you bullshit him. God damn it. I love kids like this, man. They're bad at, at playing the game, so like they run away when they have less subs than you. But when they have more subs than you, they do that. See, like they dash the shit out of you. They come at you like a fucking hat, like a bloodhound and shit. I, I love when they do that because it shows, man. It, like, it just shows they're bad at the game. Of course, you guys don't have to agree with me by any means, but that's my personal opinion. Yeah, I told you, I told you it was gonna spam fucking shit again. Fucking told you it was gonna spam shit again, dude. He tried to do a triple and that shit came out. Stupid ass. Suck a dick, bitch. You know, you know what's fun about doing that though, like the triple glitch, when they deserve it, that if they rage quit, I make a Megusta video. If they don't rage quit, I still put it up on YouTube. So either way, I win. It's lovely. All right, but uh, <clears throat> let's go to the third match. I will try to give you guys four matches. What's good, people? So it's the third match. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna give you guys four matches. So you know, we got three down after this one. And you know, I've noticed that. I've stopped deleting matches, um, you know, like the really ma the really spammy matches. I stopped deleting them, and I, you know, what I'm doing now is I'm leaving it there. Even if I lose, I'm leaving them there because it's much more easier to do videos that way, and I don't get as as stressed, I guess, because when I think, God damn, I have to re-record this one match because this fucker was spamming the whole game, and I think that's boring as fuck. But actually, some of these faggots that play like bitches sometimes make the game interesting. It's weird. It's like, I don't like it, but I like it at times. It's, it's like a fucking double standard or some shit. It's weird, man. It's like one of those things that you, you end up loving at some point, you know, after you hate it so much. But I still dislike it a lot. Don't, 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 don't think I, I, I just love it and shit and I think it's enjoyable all the time. I, I think sometimes it makes um, for amazing gameplay. And funny videos, like when people, like when people try hard, for example, right? And after they try so hard, they end up rage quitting. That shit is what gives entertaining value to like a rage quit. You know what I'm saying? Like the fact that this fucker uh, played so fucking hard and still got his ass whooped and ended up rage quitting. You know what I'm saying? Like that speaks volume to people, man. I think that's why people enjoy it. This fucker with his awakening. Oh my fucking god, dude. Hey, I got an idea. How about you don't fucking awaken, you bitch? Like, the supports that he has, too. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, there he goes with the awakening again. Almost got this, guys. Almost. Pray for Papa. Pray for Papa. Come on, Toby. Oh my god, you bitch. There you go. God damn, man. Alright, so... That was the third match. Let's go to the very last match. All right, guys. So we're in the final match, and um, I'm kind of glad I'm on the final match. Um, after this, after I'm done with this video, I have enough videos to go um, until Friday because I'm gonna schedule them for you know each day of this week. So today is Monday, and you guys are probably gonna be seeing this video like on Friday or Thursday. I'm not sure. Maybe, most likely. Yeah, most likely you guys are going to see this on Friday because I got to upload uh, first to three with Dark Renegon. So, yeah. 
And this guy is using Kakasu with heat on. But I don't give a fuck. Let's go. He doesn't have a guard support either. Yes, man. Yes. Aww. So even if, even if he B B mashes, at least he'll be vulnerable to to dashes, you know, because he doesn't have a guard support. So that's always good. I'm kind of I'm kind of disappointed though that they made Kagosu uh, the way he is now in Storm Three. I think he was such a good character. Uh, super underrated on Generations, and I even have a, had a series with him, which I really enjoyed recording. And shit, Cyber Connect to fucked that up for me, man. They made Kagusu like one of the most fucking annoying characters to fight on Storm Three, and you know, because I think, because the the thing with um, Gen was that although he had that that long reach, you know, he was slow. He was a slow character, and that's what made him unique. That's what made him underpowered and underused. Uh, because he, he was slow. He had the reach, you know, and it was good and all, but because he was slow, people didn't even, like, think to look at him twice, you know? God damn, you know? There you go. That was a good game, man. I almost lost that. Uh, well, regardless, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm out. Peace.